There goes the shrill of the whistle as the Sheffield United supporters in all four sides of the ground belt out the greasy chip butty song. Here's uh, Lowe, nice uh, ball on towards Illiman and Jai, the Senegalese international, showing his customary close control and balance. Works it infield between two Luton shirts to Akman Hodgic. Now right hand side for Max Lowe. Short option inside is Sander Berger. He will find Lowe, trying to, well, Bogle trying to burst in from the right hand side. Well, no foul there. Ball in from Bogle, it's going to be flicked up in the air. Drama will clear the ball away. They're trying to get it away as clear as far as Elijah Adebayo up top. Here's Max Lowe, will intercept and play it forward for Illiman and Jai. Looks to roll in field. Foul given against Tom Lockyer. Attacking the Bramall Lane end. Norwood teases it into the middle. It was just over the head of John Egan who was coming in. Elijah Adebayo to the far side for Carlton Morris. Jaden Bogle going with him, Morris to the byline, Morris will cross into the middle, it's over the head of Robinson who leaves it, Max Lowe will clear the ball away. The cop, for the first time, tries to get behind their team as Campbell's going to block down Robinson here, the ball's going to go behind for a loose and corner, a little slack moment there from Jack Robinson. Illiman and Jai remains forward, everyone else back. Drama into the middle, it's going to meet the head of Ollie McBurney, who heads it straight behind for a second successive corner for Rob Edwards' team. Drama once again, it's into a central area, but this time it goes over the top. Illiman and Jai, 30 yards out, and Jai to the left-hand side now for Max Lowe, quick ball out of his feet, deep towards the back stick, looking for McBurney, can Bogle keep it in? He can't. Max Lowe tries to drive to the byline, gets his cross towards the back stick, looking for Bogle back in into the arms of Horvath. Luton with the ball in the Sheffield United half. Ball crossed towards the back post, important touch by Anna Lackman Hodgich, but Bernie has been one of the uh, better lights. He gets the ball back down the right, looks to cross, it's going to be deflected, nearly runs into the path of Njai. Flick through the legs by Adebayo into Berry, that's nice from him. The striker will look to power towards goal. And Alakman Hodgic thought he got a double ricochet. Drama, it's in towards the near post. It's going to run into the middle for Marvellous Nakamba. Does he foul Ollie McBurney? Well, no, the referee allows the play to go on. Here's Bell, Osho, 30 yards from goal. Will he fancy a shot? He doesn't, he goes into the area. Adebayo, well, he took the ball away from Carlton Morris. Players inside the six-yard box where it is heavily congested. Whips centrally, Oli McBurney is there to head away. Alan Campbell will head it back in, McBurney once again. Sheffield United's best defender from set pieces. Here's Njai, McBurney with a third header clear. Great work at the back, Berger gets it clear far side. Drama over the top, one bounce in the area. Here's the free kick for Sheffield United. Ten yards in field from the left, 20 yards inside the Luton half. Norwood floats it centrally looking for McBurney. Header clear, Bogle will come across. Goes up in the air with Nakamba but loses out. Now Norwood into the tackle, fires it forward. Poor clearance by Luton and then Norwood tries to play it forward too quickly. Frankman Hodgic. Norwood then will find Berger on the edge of the area. Berger beyond his man. Can he pipe it in? He can't. It's blocked by Bell. It's a corner to the Blades. There is the half-time whistle at the lane. Robinson, it's from a fair way out. It's pretty much halfway into the half as Robinson throws it in low, looking for Egan. Didn't quite get the distance on he wanted to. Was looking towards the edge of the area. Here comes Norwood. Floats it towards the back post. Robinson with a header down. Straight in towards uh, Horvath. Now Luton will come forward. Elijah Adebayo. Alan Campbell, 25 yards from goal. The Scot is held up by Egan. Now Adebayo leaves it for Campbell. Low is there, but Adebayo comes onto the edge of the ball, puts it through the legs of Fleck. Adebayo across the middle and into the goal from Carlton Morris. Gets there just in front of Wes Fodringham. The two Luton forwards combine. And just as Sheffield United look like they finally flickered into life, it is Luton Town who strike first here at the lane. And a Bayo and Morris combine. The former Red with his 15th of the season. Eight gone second half. It's Sheffield United nil. Luton Town won. Well, Sheffield United will look to play the ball down the right now for Anna Lachman Hodgic. Lachman Hodgic with the ball across the edge of the area. Billy Sharp will turn. Sharp trying to turn his man and is quickly shut down. 
McBurney will flick on to Lowe. Lowe with the return ball to McBurney into the middle. Billy Sharp's there. Sharp can't get his shot away. Throw in from Robinson in towards McBurney. It's flicked towards the uh, far side. Billy Sharp will bring it down on his knee. Turns and goes to the byline. Turns, crosses into the area. Sharp rises well again. Helps it forward. It's cleared out of play. Norwood on the right. Norwood out of his feet and he's just piled one into the cop end plays it on the overlap here to Drama back to Morris, Morris into the box he's going to look to try and get his shot away held up by Sheffield United Morris now will turn a wide of goal from 25 yards out Norwood a run now from Egan forward Egan with the ball across the middle is an outstretched boot from Lockyer that deflects it to the far side here for Max Lowe Lowe tries to work the ball down the line it's going to come off Drama and go out of play for a throw far side Robinson with the throw Egan goes for it it's going to drop down for and Jai well he just couldn't sort his feet out Norwood Ping down the line, Ahmed Hodjic is there, it will be played behind by Onya Dinma. The corner from the right-hand side. In towards Robinson, towering header away by Carlton Morris. Norwood now on the right. Berger looked like he had his shirt held there by Onya Dinma, then Onya Dinma goes down. Here's Sharp, down the right, looking for Oli McBurney. McBurney looking to roll Bell. McBurney will dig out across. It's going to run to Billy Sharp. Then Lowe will play and dig it into the turf. Here's McAtee. Potential of a handball in there, and it's given as a hand. Doyle's going to whip one. Hits it at goal. Well, it's going to be blocked. Doyle back over the top. McBurney through, but it's into the arms of the keeper. Here's Berger on the right. Berger trying to get away from Corley Woodrow. Berger will cross into the area. It's going to be headed towards goal by McBurney. Egan forward. McBurney flicks on. Looking for Sharp on the edge of the box. Who turns, tries to take it early and hits it well wide. Now Sander Berger with some space to run into on the right for Sheffield United. He crosses into the area. McBurney with the header down. 15 yards out. Here's Woodrow, excellent flick into the area. Woodrow's round the back, shoots across goal and just wide. Sharp down the right side, Illiman and Jai will get onto the end of this. Crosses, comes off Amari Bell, bounces two or three times, goes out of play for a Sheffield United corner near side. Doyle, left arm in the air, whips it in towards the near post, it's bobbling around in the box, it's cleared behind by Adebayo. It's going to stay in play. It's going to come back out to Doyle, who pops it back into the box, looking for Ahmed Hodgic down. Bogle's there. Egan's there. Is he managed to turn the ball in? Bogle away. It's going to come off Bogle and go behind for a goal kick. Berger on the overlap. Cuts back in. Can he get across into the area? Dummies the ball. Plays it into McAtee. McAtee from the left-hand side. In towards McBurney with the header wide. Should just about be enough time for this uh, free kick. Woodrow will put it out of play. There goes the full-time whistle. 